hey guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is blanca trevino as you can see by the title of today's video it is officially my first cleaning vlog i am super excited to be bringing in these new lifestyle videos into my channel i kind of got tired of you know being all beauty because that's not all that i love I am a full-time wife and new mom, so this is literally what I am doing most of the time. And I am also super excited to say that me and my sister-in-law have launched a new Instagram called Sister Styled, where it is all about home decor, organization, food, everything that has to do with your home, we are going to post about it. So go ahead and follow Sister Styled on Instagram, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. And this particular morning, I got up and decided to make some mini pancakes for the boys. Okay, so after I finish breakfast, um, I end up just cl start cleaning up. As you can see, I just cleaned the griddle with a little bit of um, dish soap and a wet towel. And I end up just putting this away. Um, and then I just end up putting everything away from that was left from the night before, things like that. Um, on this particular day, I had made chicken wings the night before and I left the um, rack in the stove. So the next morning it smelled so bad, which is totally my fault. Um, so you can see in a little bit, I um, start cleaning up the stove with some dish soap and a wet rag. And I actually cut my hand, you'll see in a little bit, I cut my hand cleaning the stove so bad. Um, and I actually still have a scar on my right hand. Um, and then after I cleaned it, I realized there was a self um, clean button. So I ended up putting that on and I cleaned the oven for about two or three hours. this um, top shelf here um, that I'm cleaning right now on the left side of the stove where I usually just keep like all of the snacks and spices and things like that and you probably can't tell that much but I had like a bunch of teas um, just chilling on the side of the counter and I just did not like how they looked there so I ended up organizing this shelf a little bit and putting the teas away um, in that shelf. I am just unloading the dishwasher from the night before and in a little bit I am going to put more dishes in there um, I literally wash dishes I think two times a day um, it's literally my least favorite task what is your uh, least favorite task because I think mine has to be dishes or laundry I don't know I hate them both <laughs> I left some of the big pots and pans out so I can just hand wash them. I usually don't um, like to put the big pots in the dishwasher. I feel like it's just much easier to just hand wash. So that's what I'm doing now.
I also wanted to mention that every time I am cleaning, I have to listen to something, whether that be an audiobook or music. On this particular day, I was listening to a podcast called Gutful on Audible. And I really enjoyed this podcast because she's a nutritionist and she just goes really into detail about food and how it goes through our body system and things like that. I also have to clean my sink after I wash dishes. So I just put a little bit of uh, cleaning powder in there and then rinse it off with some hot water. I do the dishes I go ahead and wipe down the counters um, I love to use these yellow uh, car wipes technically they're car wipes I got them from Costco and they came in like this really big pack I've been using them for everything I just feel like they're much easier to clean than using regular towels and now I'm just cleaning the stove I will list all of the products that I use down below um, the stove always gets so dirty, um, so I always need to clean it. It just looks so much better after it's cleaned. Now I am just cleaning the fridge. As you can tell, all of our appliances in our apartment are stainless steel, which they look beautiful, but they're also so dirty all the time. So I love this stainless steel spray. And as you can see, I just cleaned up the fridge because there was just a bunch of random stuff on it. And I sprayed some of the spray onto the doors and just wiped it down. It just looks so much better afterward. Um, I use that spray for all of the appliances. Moving on to my living room. I don't think I've ever shown you guys the living room um, in this new apartment. As you can see, the living room is much bigger than our last apartment. If you were following us in our very first um, YouTube journey on our vlog channel, our living room was so tiny compared to this one. And this couch is literally the smallest thing ever. Uh, me and my husband actually hate it and it's like brand new. So we are planning on selling it. So if you're looking for a new couch, let us know. Um, we're going to look for a much, much bigger couch. Um, but for now this is fine. And the living room is pretty big but where it's never like so messy where it takes forever to clean up so I usually get this done in like 10 minutes um, as you can see we have just a bunch of random stuff in the middle table there and I'm just cleaning that up and then I'm gonna go ahead and put this baking soda on the carpet um, this is the pet fresh baking soda I put this all over the carpet and I let it sit for a couple of minutes before I vacuum I have a couple plants that were gifted to me so I just put these on the window and I try to water them once or twice a week. After I am done with the living room, I just go in with my vacuum and try to vacuum the hardwood, hardwood floors. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, usually I do sweep, but I find that the vacuum um, has been working perfectly fine. Um, and I just go in with the broom to get in those hard to reach corners. Um, and then after I sweep and uh, vacuum the hardwood floors, I use my shark steamer. I'll go ahead and list this one 
comment down below i love this steamer i also bought it on black friday and all you need is water to steam the hardwood floors um, you, you'll see right now I grab a little bit of some essential oils and I drop it into the mop and this just helps when the steam goes off it helps um, the hardwood floor like smell really nice and the scent that I used was eucalyptus and I really enjoyed it um, but yeah guys that is pretty much it I finish off with just cleaning the floors and I don't think I filmed um, an outro for this video so just go ahead and enjoy the rest of the vlog i hope you guys enjoyed it i had so much fun making this for you guys i love cleaning cleaning is literally what i do half of the time i'm not even kidding so if you guys like these videos go ahead and like subscribe and comment down below because i have a lot more video ideas coming for you guys thank you guys so much bye